Hey guys, Joshua Gundamo here with another Gundam MSI review, and today we're reviewing the Zeus Gundam from G Gundam. The Zeus Gundam is one of those uh, interesting figures. It's kind of different. Go over the weapons first. Has this uh, lightning bolt kind of hammer thing here. Fit in his hand, like so. And uh, its other weapon is a sword, which has a nice sheath and uh, also fits in the hand quite nicely. Comes with two closed fists, like this one, and two open hands. You can see them down here. It also comes with two sets of wings. It has these outspread wings, which just come off. And then, uh, let's see the little tabs there. These just go in his uh, downwards wings. Now for the articulation. The head does not turn 360 degrees because it's got a big beard. But it's not a ball joint, has reasonable mouth flexibility. The boosters have a little bit of wiggle room. Backpack can come off. The arms turn 360 degrees. They turn here as well. The hand turns 360 degrees. And it has an elbow joint. The waist does not turn very much. You might be able to force it, but it does not, uh, not very much really. That is forcing it. <laughs> so not much flexibility there. Legs go this far forwards, this far back. Knee joint and uh, the foot joint. Foot joint has a lot of flexibility in there. It has this thing here that moves, kind of like the Ground Tech Gundam's foot cover. And that covers the articulation for the figure. It's not a bad figure, but uh, it's, it's kind of simple. The thing that you need to watch out for, well, let me know that uh, this figure comes in two different ways. There's the single individual Zeus Gundam, and then there's a Zeus Gundam uh, box set where he has his mobile horse chariot. Uh, which I'll review at a later time. The thing you need to watch out for when you buy this guy is these sword hilts, they're kind of riveted in there, and, well, as you can imagine, if you just throw them in a box, it tends to break off. And so, when you find one on, on you know, used, make sure to ask whether it was uh, glued on or if it's broken or anything like that because they just have a really bad habit of breaking off. If yours does break off, just put it in whatever place that you want it and just apply some super glue and that fixes it pretty quick. Uh, can't move around, but you know, you got your sword hilt. Well, that's been our review of the Zeus Gundam. Hope you liked it. Uh, if you're looking for G Gundams or other kinds of Gundams, UC or Seed or whatever, make sure to check out our eBay store, Gundams R Us, your favorite arms dealer. There's a link down below in the more info area and we get new stuff all the time. Make sure to leave me comments about what you'd like to see me review next. Catch you guys later.